Maybe you're someone that doesn't want to do a multi-day fast. You just want to feel as if your body is cleansing itself by abstaining from food for just one day, a single 24-hour period. That's understandable. And you may want to know the effects this 24-hour period of strictly consuming only water will have on your body, say in measures of weight, blood pressure, cholesterol, blood sugar, and more. Well, you're in the right place. I'm going to walk you through a bit of data from a study that recruited 30 people and had them simply undergo a single day of water fasting. And they measured different health metrics before the fast and then obviously after the fast, and then simply compared the differences between those two endpoints. So what did they find? In measures of body weight, an area that I like to kick things off in most of my content, these people experienced a reduction in their weight by about one and a half kilograms. Now, it's important to contextualize that because most likely that weight loss was not, in large part, fat. It was likely dominated by water weight from the loss of glycogen or stored sugar in the muscles and liver. Is it possible some marginal amount of fat was lost? Possible, but unlikely. However, there's a different story in relation to blood sugar, insulin, and insulin resistance measures. So blood sugar did decrease about 9%, which may not seem like much, but considering that these people had already normal blood sugar levels, the effect is pretty substantial. In measures of insulin, the effects were even more dramatic, actually much more, showing an 80% reduction in blood insulin levels. So that doesn't come as a shock considering if you don't consume anything, there's no stimulus for the blood insulin or blood sugar to rise, and they will then fall. So if I tell you that there's a reduced blood sugar and dramatic reductions in insulin, what would you guess happened to insulin resistance? If you think it would decrease, then you're absolutely right. That's exactly what happened. So we know that even as little as one day water fast produces profound effects on blood sugar, insulin, and insulin resistance. But how about cardiovascular health, heart health? Taking a look at triglycerides and cholesterol or blood fats, uh, we see that there's substantial decrease in triglyceride levels, yet we see a substantial increase in cholesterol levels. On top of that, blood pressure measurements were unchanged, so they didn't improve. But believe it or not, these results aren't unique to this study, since I've covered a few other studies on water fasting that showed some intriguing results in this arena. While I do feel the lack of results in blood pressure is merely a time effect, meaning not enough time passed, the increased cholesterol is not isolated to this study, not to mention counterintuitive results related to triglycerides. So what's going on here? Well, if you're interested, I have a three-part series that begins with a video on five days of water fasting and begins to make sense of these confusing results. Let's make sense of it all. I'll speak to you there.